W2, it's Turbo Trail. I'm up on the water. Smoking some Boswell's Piper's Pleasure. Very, very flavorful blend. I believe this is one of Pipe Lawyer's uh, top aromatics of 2012. That's where I heard about it from, and, and the reason I got it, so kudos to him for pointing me in the right direction. <clears throat> I forget now off the top of my head what all he had to say about it, because I guess since I'm trying to review it, it's a good thing. Very, uh, very flavorful blend. This one's one of the more heavily uh, flavored blends that Boswell has. You can really pick out a lot of stuff. I get to a, a coffee. I get this. I get the vanilla. I get a, a nuttiness. It's really, really, uh, really nice nutty flavor. Could be the cob contributing to that because sometimes I do get a nutty flavor when I smoke with a cob. As long as you smoke it slow and cool. These little cobs are great. I am using a filter, so full disclosure on that. You know, that helps keep the smoke from being too moist and stops backflow. But uh, do a real short review on this one. Uh, Piper's Pleasure. I think that, you know, I, I, I have heard people getting tongue bite from this. Uh, I've gotten tongue bite from Boswell's blends, but as I mentioned before, I'm not really, really sure which blend it was. Could have been because I was smoking too fast or something that I did also. At this point with this blend, it doesn't feel bitey. Uh, but it's more so than say a Boswell's Best. I could see if you smoke this, a very big bowl of this, you know, a big chimney full of it. You would, uh, you might, you might get a little tongue by it, but uh, I wouldn't call it. I wouldn't call it bitey by no means. Just in comparison to, say, Boswell's Best, which is much less cased. This one would be more likely to give you tongue bite. But you know, compared to say, like Captain Black or just about any over the counter, this one's a uh, much, much higher quality. And the, the flavor experience is uh, far superior. Very, very tasty tobacco. Uh, Boswell blends, you know, I've, I've got so many different ones, and I've only got a quarter of what they make in aromatics. There's really none that I don't like. It's actually kind of hard to choose, you know, when I open my cooler door and go rooting through it. Uh, sometimes it's hard for me to pick out which one I want. Uh, I got a lot of other flavored tobaccos, a lot of other, I've got some Englishes, and I've got a lot of other uh, types of aromatics in there, but I find myself going for the Boswells every time, you know, every time. They, they just hit the aromatics out of the park. So if you like aromatics and you haven't tried Boswells, give them a shot. If you ever thought about smoking Captain Blacks and those type of things, do you think those taste good? Man, give give Boswell's a try because their stuff just blows all that out of the water. Uh, definitely some of the top aromatic stuff I've ever smoked. Fantastic uh, blend, uh, a Piper's pleasure. And uh, you know when you order from uh, Boswell's, there's, there's no online order. You call them on the phone and they take your order by phone. And you know you talk to a person who actually works there and not in a call center somewhere. You actually talk to somebody who looks over their shoulder and go, oh yeah, I see that over there on the shelf, you know, so it's it's kind of a unique experience this day and age. Fantastic company, so, you know, support your uh, brick and mortars, and, and Boswell's, even though, you know, you call them in order all over the places, it's still a small brick and mortar. Uh, plus, according to guys like Pipe Lawyer, a fantastic custom, um, you know, pipe maker, customer but uh, you know they're they, they make a uh, fantastic handmade pipes I'd love to uh, I'd love to try to get one of those myself but they're, they're kind of hard to come by right now uh, 
YouTube community is <laughs> tearing up all the pipes. Can't hardly get an order in anywhere. Uh, two thumbs up from the Tobo Trail on Piper's Pleasure. Definitely uh, give it a try if you put a Basel orders in. And uh, keep on smoking. This is uh, Smoke on the Water. Just a quick little uh, update there. Uh, only smoked uh, Englishes last watch and one small bowl of Piper's Pleasure and I do have a slight case of tongue bite. Um, you know, it tastes fantastic but it's definitely the one out of the bunch, the only one I've found so far that, that does give you uh, you know, tongue bite. It's not a severe case, I've had a lot worse. It won't stop me from even smoking but my tongue was sensitive uh, when I got up I could tell. So uh, yeah it's definitely uh, definitely the Piper's Pleasure. But. It does, uh, it does taste good, but I smoked it very, very slowly, uh, you know, kept cool, you smoked in the cob, so shouldn't have been bitey, but, uh, you know, by anything that I was doing, you know, I didn't rush it, wasn't busy, just relaxed and sipped it. I do have just the slightest taste of tongue bite, though, so, yep, uh, it's Turbo Trail.